In 2022, action and campaign against the climate crisis are every day more important. Environmental disaster, droughts and shortages of food are commonplace. A research demonstrates that the energy wasted by companies in one year across UK could power London for seven years. What action can we take? Today we are here uh, to speak about a concern that affects all of us as humans. To preserve history uh, in museums is mandatory to have air conditioning and to have that we have to spend a large amount of electricity which is not good for our planet. As with many museums we have a, an air conditioning system which is quite expensive to run and we're wondering whether we can reduce that energy consumption. We store many of our objects in pretty good boxes and uh, they're also protected by rolling racking. So what we're wondering is whether we can reduce our energy consumption. What we want to do is to run an experiment over the next year where we monitor the environment within boxes and see whether there's fluctuations in temperature and humidity and whether if the temperature remains quite stable in the boxes, whether we could perhaps uh, turn down the air conditioning, turn it off for periods and reduce our energy consumption. So what we need to do is to buy some small monitoring devices that we can place around the store and in different boxes in different locations so we can test all of this over time and see how the fluctuations are going and what happens if we change the settings on the air conditioning. MODA is following the example of the National Museums of Wales which has found that turning off climate control measures, temperature and humidity remain within acceptable parameters. This has enabled the organization to reduce their energy costs. If this example were to be followed by all museums, archives and libraries worldwide, the figures are colossal and the impact on the planet will be very powerful indeed.